hey guys welcome back to my channel just want to give a quick shout out and say thanks so much for being the first to comment on my last video so for today's video we're going to be using my extra short round soft gel full nail covers uh, these are available for purchase in my etsy shop and as always i'll be sure to leave the link down below I love full nail covers. They just make life so much easier when doing nails. Um, and if you never tried them before, definitely recommend giving them a try. They really do just make life so much easier and the whole nail applying process so much faster. So here, all I'm doing is going in and making sure that they fit my nails wall to wall. also be using my solid nail tip glue gel in this video and a link will be down below but um i love this stuff it literally you think just using the soft gel full nail covers makes the process easier these two combined is just chef's kiss it makes the whole process of applying nails just super speedy super easy and super beginner friendly um, so like I said, if you haven't tried it before, recommend giving it at least a try. Um, it, it's really beginner friendly and you definitely get the hang of it after one to two tries. Um, only thing is when you're going in and you're scooping the solid glue gel out, sometimes you may scoop out too much and when you press it on your nails, it may squeeze along the cuticles and the outsides of the nails. So all you're gonna do is just scrape the sides of that before curing. And you really just wanna make sure you do that before curing um, because it can be kind of hard to remove after the fact. But yeah, so as you can see, I did multiple nails at once and then I went in and did a full cure, which was about one and a half to two minutes. And as always, I do my thumbs separately Alrighty, so here's what they're looking like. Now we're gonna go in and begin filing. I got these nail files from Amazon and they are 8080 grit nail files. I say it in every video, if you've never tried an 8080 grit file, try it. They are a game changer. They just make your nails super crisp, super sharp, super clean. Um, and I think I got a pack of like 50 of them for like $7.99. I got like an amazing deal. So if I can find that deal again, I'll be sure to leave it down below. So I didn't show this part, but I used these two drill bits on my cuticle areas to clean up the cuticles. And then after I did that, I went in with this buffer and just buffed my nails before we apply polish. So I'm using this Beatles polish. Um, I love Beatles polish. All of my nail polishes are basically either Beatles or Mercart. So, and I love the size of the bottles. At first I was like, these bottles are like super small, but let's be real. It takes me a long, long time to use like up a whole bottle, unless it's like a basic essential color, like white or black or like a nude that you use a lot. Beatles polishes are great because they come in these nice tiny bottles and you get a whole bunch of different colors. So I recommend giving them a try if you're in the market for gel polishes and you're not sure what to get. They're super affordable and uh, they are available for purchase on Etsy. I'm sorry, Amazon. Um, and I do have a storefront where I link some of my favorite Beatles kits. Um, so I'll be sure to link the one that has this specific shade down below. But yeah, all I'm going in and doing is applying two coats. This gel polish is super pigmented. You really only need one, but I always 
do too. It's just a habit. Um, but now I'm going in and I'm going to apply my top coat before we apply the chrome powder. This top coat is by Model Ones and this is not a no wipe top coat. I'm not sure if there's a difference, but I, I always never use a no wipe top coat when applying chrome powder. Um, so yeah, just a side note there. I kind of feel like it like sticks better. So I got this white chrome powder from Amazon and um, last time I checked it was sold out. I hope it's not anymore but if not I'll be sure to leave the link down below and if it is then I'll try and find like a close dupe. But I absolutely love this white chrome powder. It definitely is essential. Um, a lot of people were trying to get their hands on it to do like that Hailey Bieber nail set that like went viral and that's when I went and purchased it. So. I love it. I use it on like all nail colors and it just gives like a perfect like white balanced look instead of like a chrome that has like an undertone to it. So I love it. I definitely recommend it. It's an essential and it's super easy to apply. So now all I'm doing is cleaning up around the cuticle areas. You can do this before or after applying your gel polish um, top coat but I just tend to do it beforehand. So I'm just cleaning it up with a lint-free wipe and some alcohol. And then after this, I'm gonna apply that same top coat and cure. And now I'm just going in with another lint-free wipe and just wiping down my nails. And the last and final step is cuticle oil. Today I'm going in with the scent Lavender. These are my cuticle oils that are available for purchase in my Etsy shop. They're ultra hydrating and made with all natural flowers. So I definitely recommend getting your hands on a good cuticle oil. Uh, but here's the final design super cute i love like the bubblegum cotton candy pink chrome vibe if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave me a like comment and subscribe i love you guys so so much and i will catch you in my next video bye